it's Nurgle. Welcome back to Metropolis, where a ragtag team of archaeologists explore an abandoned planet Earth 3,000 years in the future. And how do they do that? Puzzle solving and lateral thinking. Of course. Let's get going. So last time, we kind of discovered the area where Total is. And I don't think there's a whole lot else to do on this floor. So let's we, we need to go to the hangar, I believe they said. So let's see if we can do that now. The hangar is on the first floor. Petra could help me get hold of a hover jet. Okay. Let's go to the... I need to talk to Petra. Yeah. Let's go to the first floor. Oops, sorry. Just smacked my microphone. Boom. I apologize. We've discovered dozens of illustrations of this species, but not a single fossil. The Dean insisted we get a hologram, but if you ask me, they're as mythical as Dwayne the Rock Johnson. <laughs> He's reading his own user manual. In public. Ugh. <laughs> Good morning, Doctor. Hey there, kid. Johan Solo? Whenever I try to pet it, I nearly lose an eye. Why? Whenever I try to pet it, I nearly lose an eye. I'm confused. Hey, is that a thermometer? A chromatic thermometer. They change color with temperature. Mm. In extreme cold, the liquid turns purple. Neat. You have to be careful, though. The colors fix on contact with air. Mm. Last winter, one of these exploded in Micro's hand. Oh, jeez. Its face was still blue in the spring. Looks like it's detachable. Carefully now. Hey, neat. Got a thermometer. What's in here? At last. I should be able to find a hover jet here. I need to ask Petra. Hold on, let me go back. I want to see something else here. Is there anything else that we can do around here? Anything about... Oh, what's this? What shall I buy today? Uh, food, 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 food. Let's see. Sure, something looks like sushi rolls. The machine's not active. I can't place any orders without my official ID. Ah, got it. I've got my ID right here. Boop. That won't work. Why not? Perfect. I'm hungry. Yeah. Error. ID expired. What? Drat. I forgot to renew my card. Duck on it. Okay, well, so much for that. Well, that's annoying. All right, fine. We'll go talk to Petra. Let's see now. What's this? Boxes? For the attention of Dr. Shale and Dr. Ruby. They must be in the geology department. <laughs> Who's this? Wanted. Purple hair. For public disorder, sedition, and assaulting a prize-winning miniature pincher. <laughs> beat up a dog. They're an endangered species. <laughs> a monster. Don't beat up dogs. Don't matter if they're endangered or not. Don't beat up animals. What the heck? That's Petra. Let's talk to her. Hello, Petra. Henry, I was hoping to bump into you. I heard about Total. What the heck? Anything new? No word from the kidnappers. Yeah. But the security cops will find him. Oh, shit. Kinda closed the case. Yeah. What? Because they suck. That's why I'm here. We're going to look for him. Yeah. I really hope he's all right. Total always brings jelly babies to departmental meetings. Can't imagine this place without him. We'll get him back, Petra. Yeah. We need a vehicle. This is about finding Total, right? Absolutely. Then maybe I won't notice you sneaking out without a flight permit. What kind of bird do you need? Long distance atmospheric travel. Several passengers. Let me see. The bikes are too small for the twins to go with you. Yeah. Besides, they don't have much range. Well, that's not good. The whale is grounded for maintenance. I got it. And the Vice Dean just took our last two hover jets to the Olympus Mons Fondue Spa. Oh, for Pete's sake. The is that hover jet in the middle. But it's not ours. It's a freelance contractor. You'll have to negotiate with the pilot. Oh, for Pete's Fondue. sake. Let me know if you need anything else. All right, fine. Let's see. Is there anything else here? Yeah, let's take a look here. Motorcycles. The bikes are no use. They're for short distance travel. Mm -hmm. Besides, they're too small and too scary. Yeah. I can't take a transport of that size. It's a passenger ship. I don't understand what this hand is. Can I not? Okay, I can't, I can't interact with the wavy hand. Let's see. There's nothing. We looked at the box. Hey, wait, what's that? Hey, screwdriver. It doesn't look like Yoink. anything. Yoink. <laughs> Boy. 
It's a cryo crate. Hey. Hey what? The label says FAO Lab C. Expedition Supervisor H. Dijon. It's a package for me. Hey, neat. Let's see, hold on. Did we take it? Hmm. It's a cryo crate. The label says FAO Lab. For the attention of Dr. Shale, it must be in the okay. energy department. All right, let's go talk to this uh, pilot. Let's see what Mr. Pilot's got to say. Hey, buddy, what's up? Hello. What's up, kid? Is this your ship? Yeah. No. Who wants to know? I do. Dr. Henry Dijon. I want to hire your hoverjet. I want to hire your hoverjet. Okay. Here's the deal. Discreet service. No questions asked. Special discount for archaeologists. <laughs> no way. I'm an archaeologist. <laughs> no kidding. This is your lucky day. <laughs> I don't know the precise destination, but pretty far away. We talking what? 50 clicks here? No, much further. Sector 7. Sector 7? <laughs> Forget it, kid. I don't leave Sector 2. Oh, for Pete's sake. But your hoverjet could easily take us to Sector 7. Yeah. It's not that simple. Why not? I'm getting too much heat on the border right now. Damn security cops won't leave me alone. <sighs> enough to make you want to quit smuggling. I mean... I, I shouldn't have said smuggling. Forget I said smuggling. <laughs> I love Sector 2 too much. <laughs> Good old Tui. Go Eagle next, etc. Really, need your hover jet. Need your hover jet. No can do. Why would I leave Sector 2? Nobody knows me here. Nobody's looking for me. Not that they're looking for me anywhere else, you understand. I'm the <laughs> hover jet pilot. Mm -hmm. Why are you so jumpy? Why are you so jumpy? I don't like those security cops. Breathe them down my neck. Fair enough. I'm just an honest hover jet pilot. Hmm. But the big house whew, is full of innocent guys like me. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Have you seen those wanted posters? That's purple here. He assaulted the mayor's miniature pincher. And I heard he beat up his dog too. What the heck? There's a dangerous criminal on the loose. You'd think the security cops would be too busy to harass honest hover jet pilots. But no. I'll leave, I'll leave you alone. Watch your step. Okay. Go this way. There was somebody over here. Who is this? Hey, it's the police. Alert! An unidentified subject is approaching, Captain. Execute Protocol A, Lieutenant. Don't you mean Protocol C, Captain? Why? What's A? Use of lethal force. What about C? Rendition for torture. Ah, for Pete's sake. Which is the one where you ask them who they are? Protocol Q. Execute Protocol Q. Affirmative, Captain. You there. Me? Here? I... <laughs> uh, doctor... <laughs> Henry Dijon. I'm an archaeologist. You work here, punk? Yeah, I'm head of expeditions in Team Sigma. Yeah. Sigma? The ones who lost the man in the terrestrial jungle? Yep, that's us. <laughs> Bad luck, that man. <laughs> the jungle's a dangerous place. Hmm. Can you help rescue my boss? Help rescue my boss. I've uncovered new evidence about the kidnapping. Yeah. Good news. We've just received a memo to the effect that the case has been closed. Oh, for Pete's sake. Get out there. Do you guys ever actually solve crime? I think the answer is no. Yes. As a matter of fact, we rescued a cat from a very large tree. Okay. Last month. Well, that's good. Not personally, you understand, but we read the memo. Of course. <laughs> that guy by the hover jet looks suspicious. Maybe you should check him out. Put the squeeze on him. He doesn't fit the perp's description, Captain. Yeah. As you've seen the posters, the suspect we're looking for has purple hair. Of course. Call him... Purple hair. Indeed. If purple hair dyed his hair. <gasps> that would be totally catastrophic for our investigation. <laughs> we, 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 we <laughs> <laughs> okay, luck. Thank you, son. Okay, what else do we have here? Okay, the box. A little black opening, but no keyhole. Hmm. Hands off that security property. I'm sorry, officer. Damn civilians. Always fiddle first, ask questions later. You're damn right, Captain. Hey, language. Go ahead, Dr. Dijon. What are you keeping that receptacle? In that blue receptacle. Lost and found items. Correction, item. Since there's only one item in there today. Can I see if it's mine? Yes. I mean, no. How do I know you're not going to take something that doesn't belong to you? 
Very sharp, that man. So how can I prove the item is mine? Yeah. Describe the object you've lost, and I'll tell you if it's in the receptacle. Okay, the object I've lost is... Is it an animal? Nope, not an animal. Is it edible? Yes, I suppose it's edible. Is it cooked? I wouldn't say cooked, no. It's cold then. Very cold. Hmm. So it's sickle. Oh, yeah. I know your game, Sunshine. Damn hey. I almost had it. When you can remember exactly what you lost, come and tell us. Ice cubes. I think I've lost something. I'd like to retrieve my item from your lost and found receptacle, please. Kindly describe the item you claim to have lost, Dr. Dijon. Well, it's very cold. Yeah. Should we give it to him, Captain? No! He wheedled that information out of you. Oh, for Pete's sake, you remember that, huh? Yeah, All right, fine. My memory is fuzzy. I'll be back when I remember what I lost. All right. Good luck. Thank you, son. Uh, let's talk to this guy again. See if he can give us some more information. What do you guys say, buddy? Have you lost anything lately? What? Why? Are you screwing up? You gotta tell me. No. The officers over there told me they found a lost item. Yeah. I thought it might be yours. Oh. Sounds valuable. I say we split it 50-50. You win? Sure. You want to steal it? Don't go soft on me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in. I'm in. You're in the front. Perfect. All I need is a distraction. You find something to draw the security. Hmm. Attention. Leave the rest to me. Okay. Uh... I'll leave you alone. Mm. Keep out of trouble, kid. Okay. Okay. All right, go this way. Okay. Let's see. Uh, oh, that's the way out. Okay. Oh, I didn't miss that. I thought it was a window. It's a little cloudy. It's a little cloudy. Hmm. Talk to the police. I don't think we can just... Can we... Go ahead, Dr. Dijon. Uh, no. Thank you, son. All right, let's see. Here's a cone. Hands off that security cop property. All right, fine. Jerk. All right, let's see. So, let's see. We can't... It says way up, but we really can't go out that way. That's interesting. It's a little cloudy. Yeah, it's not letting us... Not letting us go out. Okay, yeah, that's fine. Head over here. And into here. Um, yesterday, <gasps> probably. What is that? Thank you, doctor. Wait. Stop. You can't just walk around an outfit like that and not. Hold on. <laughs> Where'd she go? Where'd she go? Oh, for Pete's sake. What the heck? You can't just walk around an outfit like that and not want to talk to people. Rude. Oh, we can go out here. Okay. Ooh, outside. Huh? Tree in bloom. My goodness. Who are these people? Hi, people. So many students come through the university. Well, sure. Monolith. This monolith. It's an awfully small monolith. Hello? Somebody there? No response. Hmm. Identification in process. Fingerprint recognized. Uh -huh. Henry Dijon. Access level two. Access denied. What? This terminal requires access. Oh, for Pete's sake. Three. Section managers and technical operators only. Have a nice day. Dr. Dijon. Damn. I could be a level three. I know Total was about to promote me. Yeah. Okay, stupid thing. I don't want to trample over the uh, harmonious energies. <laughs> uh, let's see what's over here. <laughs> Nobody wants to trample on harmonious energies. Ooh. They suspect nothing. Wait a minute. What's that? Cobra's voice. Got it. The sound must be coming from the upper floor, but our lab isn't even on this side of the building. Hmm. They're going to search for Total on their own. No, I got it. I can keep an eye on them. Hmm. Yeah, I'll be nice to the four-eyed redhead. 
It's easy to earn his trust. He's never been very smart. Hey. Who is she talking about? I have the coordinates. They are safely stowed in my secret lab. Secret lab? In the elevator. Yeah, I got it. What the splurp? I missed you too. See you in a few days. Whoa. This place has incredible acoustics. I don't <laughs> like this at all. No. Cobra spying on us. Well, yes. <laughs> hidden in the elevator. Well, she's clearly spying on you. <gasps> Cthulhu. Warning. Don't use the goods hoist as a ladder. It's <laughs> dangerous and leads nowhere. <laughs> Thank you. An archaeologist can always use <laughs> Boy, you've got really sticky fingers, buddy. <laughs> I thought that would be easier. <laughs> Only a small length of rope came free. I guess it'll have to do. Let's see. Did we get did we get that small length of rope? Okay, we did. Good. Steps. Climbing up would be risky. Yeah. I don't even know what level Cobra was on. Oh, come on. You only live once. 20 floors I don't have access to. But she right. said she had something hidden in the elevator. I should start there. Okay. The totem. Let's check out the totem. Look at the bird. Touching this ancient wood makes me feel peaceful. Oh, that's nice. Hey, a bunch of cats. How did I miss that? I should let sleeping cats lie. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so let's head back in here. Let's see now. There's the elevator. We can't do anything with that. We can't do anything with that. Okay, let's let's head back. To the basement. Well, since I've been to the basement, hmm. it always smells like embalming fluid. But charming. Hi, Henry. Ew. <gasps> no, thank you. I did a whole semester on ancient handguns. They've never been my favorite kind of relic. Fair Someone enough. else was obsessed with them, though. Who was that? Cobra. Oh, yeah. Micro. Oh, micro, huh? Henry! I wasn't going to touch it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, hey! Henry! Quit poking around. I know how fragile relics can be. Come on. Alright, fine. We'll talk to you. Big jerk. Hi, Frida. Carlotta told me about Total. Yeah. How could this happen? I don't know, but we're going to figure it out. Yeah. I've narrowed it down to the Cabal or the Shadow Government. Hmm. <laughs> of course, they both operate from the hollow core of Mars, so uh, it could be the regular government in cahoots with the shadow government. Probably not. Have you considered they might be in cahoots? My guess is treasure hunters. In cahoots with... Not in cahoots. No cahoots. You're so naive, sweet child. I just hope you find him before the aliens do. Me too. Where's the rest of your team? Where's the rest of your team? They just left for an expedition, as if we didn't have enough finds from the last one. What did you discover? Yeah. The remains of a 19th century police station. Hmm. Lots of firearms, projectiles, the usual. But we also found a few very rare. Ooh, like what? It's taken me a week, but I've restored everything. What's your access level? You're a head of department. What's your access level? I'm level three. Why do you ask? Level three? Wow. Henry, there are a hundred levels. <laughs> Level three is good enough for me. There's a monolith near the entrance I need to use. Can you give me access? Absolutely not. No. I could get fired if anyone found Nobody's out. Nobody's gonna find out. Someone will find out. Yeah. Discretion is my middle name. Yep. I didn't know that. That's how discreet I am. <laughs> No. no. It won't take long. You're not going to convince me. There's got to be a way to get Frida's fingerprint. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Nice flask. I expect you touch it with your fingers all the time. So, can I borrow it? I need it. I'm trying to pour the ionic preservative into the mummy's mouth. Hmm. But I can't get it open. If I give you a hand with that, how about you give me the flask? Ooh. Sure. 
Whatever. I got a bunch of flasks. But we have to open the mummy's mouth without damaging the hmm. specimen. Okay. Hey, look at that. Let's see, hold on. How about this hook? No, okay. Well, maybe we don't have what we need for this. I'm trying to think, what would we, uh, paper clip, maybe? No. The rope, of course. Nope. All right, well, we'll, we'll come back for this one. Let's give this some thought. I hope it's not too decayed. Let's see. Hey, hey, hey! Henry! Oh, come on. You know how fragile relics can be. I'm fine. Alright, big baby. Okay. Uh, let's head back to level two, to the laboratories. Nice. Wait a minute, hold on. Actually, I want to do one more thing. I want to check and see... So we were able to ask, let's see, can we talk to him? Good morning, Doctor. The bird woman you were talking to? Yeah. What did she want? Yeah. Nothing important. Just asking about Total's disappearance. Hmm. She was worried, I guess. Okay. He's reading his own in public. Okay. Let's go and let's, let's see if we can find out who different people's, um, maybe we can find out, let's see, uh, what access level are you? You're a head of department. What's your access level? I shouldn't really say, but I'm a level 10 engineer. Oh, it's Clerp. I thought five was the highest level for engineers. I bet you did. Why do you want <laughs> I to... Bet you what does that mean? the entrance I want to use, but it's level three access only. You mean the black monolith? That's a biothermal console, but I can't help you. Wrong department. No, oh, that got it. can't access biotech devices. No. Did you see a bird woman pass through here? Yeah. No. No one's coming here apart from you. Hmm. That's strange. You lose something you in the hangar? Happen to lose something in the hangar. What yeah. do you mean? The secure cops told me there's an item in Lost and Found. Yeah. I haven't lost anything. Let me ask around. Okay. Hey, have you guys lost anything? Yeah, actually. When I was young, I had this, this, you know, hope that things would get... <laughs> <laughs> we haven't lost anything. Yeah. <laughs> okay. There's a package over there with my name on it. Yeah. yeah, that's possible. We haven't dealt with the deliveries yet. Okay. Do it now. Sorry, I have to stick to correct procedure. No. First thing is a roll Fine. call, then a full vehicle clean. Oh, for Pete's sake. Then we do package delivery. Oh man. I understand. No one values correct procedure more than me. <laughs> really? As soon as we finish cleaning the whale, I'll get right onto the deliveries. All right. <laughs> uh, fine. I've got to go. Henry, Let's okay. Yes. Good luck. Thanks. She's so nice. Let's see if the does the pilot have some kind of uh What's up, kid? You've planned have you seen those one of posters? I need to have your nah, I'll we'll leave them alone. Fine. Yeah. Keep out of trouble, kid. Okay. So let's head back over here, go back upstairs. See what the splurp is going on. So now we know that Cobra is up to something. Hmm. What could she be up to? I'm not sure. We'll find out. But that's going to be next time. Thanks for watching this playthrough of Metropolis. Coming up next, we have to somehow get access to a level 3 fingerprint so that we can access that tiny, tiny, tiny little monolith. Thanks for watching again. I'll see you next time for more Metropolis. See you then.